the dark ages. He's always had a body of believers who preached and shared the word of God by its core, its essence. And it hasn't changed in these last days. Think about that. Yes. And the leadership is being demon possessed, as I speak. The people in there have a final chance to come out. So he said, come out of Babylon because I'm becoming the habitation of demons. So our message now is to call all the sincere people out of Babylon. Mm -hmm. yeah. We have one last chance. Amen. Amen. Okay, let's go back to the book of Daniel chapter 4. Daniel chapter 4 and verse 30. Daniel chapter 4 and verse 30. And here we're going to see that Babylon is a man-made system based on human traditions and achievements, okay? So verse 30 says, The king spoke, saying, Is not this great Babylon that I have built for royal dwelling by my mighty power and for the honor of my majesty? Well, that's kind of like an eye syndrome, isn't it? <laughs> That, that is impressive, the language that is being used there. Isaiah so, 14, the great eye. The great eye, absolutely. Mm -hmm. And let's go to Isaiah, by the way. Let's go to uh, chapter 45 and verse 22. Mm -hmm. Isaiah 45 and verse 22. Mm -hmm. Isaiah 45 and verse 22. <clears throat> And it says, Look at me and be saved, all you ends of the earth, for I am God, and there is no other. Again, God is the, the rightful ruler of the universe. Amen? He is our king. He is our author. He is everything to us. Without him, we could do nothing. Yes? What scripture? Oh, you said Isaiah? 45, verse 22. Okay. Thank you. Okay, and I'm going to finish up with this. I'm going to split it in half today because time is already getting away from us. Uh, let's finish up today. Let's go back to Jeremiah chapter 51 and verse 47. Jeremiah chapter 51 and verse 47. <clears throat> Jeremiah 51 verse 47. says, therefore, behold, the days are coming that I will bring judgment on the carved images of Babylon. Her whole land shall be ashamed, and all her slain shall fall in her midst. Pretty strong statement, don't you think? Mm -hmm. Think about that. Ancient Babylon filled her temple with idols, so it will show and demonstrate spiritual Babylon in every amazing way. It's incredible, you know, having been raised Catholic. And again, I'm not picking on Catholics. Not the beautiful people. It's the system that's right. that we question. That's right. And that's what we always have to keep in mind. And I am guilty. There have been times in my past, even recent past, I have been critical of individuals, and I should not be. But with that said, God reminds me, it's the system, John. It's the system. And, and, and we can never forget because God wants to save all men, does he not? He doesn't say some, he says all of them. So as servants of God, we must put on the blood of Jesus Christ and share the grace through repentance to all these beautiful people that are waiting to receive the gift of salvation. Amen? Amen. All right, we'll finish this up next Sabbath. But that will have a keel come up.